Chess friends, look at this position, very distinguished cramped position, this game is played between Vichy Arnand and Joel Latier, white to move and win, can you find the brilliant move for Arnand? The bishop is under attack, and the rook is also targeted by the two pieces, if you find bishop to g6, then congratulation you are correct, I will take you the position later, first show me the brilliant game of Vichy Arnand, so, let's go, we have e4, d4, e takes d4, queen takes, Scandinavian defense, knight here, the queen can run any of these square, queen a5, we have queen a5 by black, d4, knight here, knight to f3. Bishop to f5 is flexible move here, but we have c6 which is also good, bishop c4, bishop here, knight here, bishop and knight together creating threat on there, so e6, in this position guys, Vichy played absolutely critical move g4, he says I am a stockfish subscriber, let me with stockfish level, and chess friends, if you haven't subscribed our channel yet, then you can subscribe to get more episodes of stockfish, in Scandinavian defense, g4 is good move to play, bishop backs, we have h4, threatening to trap the bishop, if you think h5 is good move here, then knight takes bishop, because you moved your h pawn, it loses the guard on g6 bishop, so after f takes g6, the pawn will be target for the bishop, queen will arrive to target this, if you move your king to f7, try to protect both of these pawns, then g5, targeting the knight, if the knight runs away, the f file will be totally open, then bring your rook to join the f file, which will be bad for black king, because the king is exposed. So in this position, we have knight to d7, knight takes, takes, h5, bishop comes to e4, you might play castle, which is not bad, but Vichy moved up his rook on h3, he want to play bishop d2, f3, targeting this, if bishop runs away then knight takes bishop will be a discover attack to the queen, and you will lose the bishop, so in this position, we have rook to g2, targeting this, rook slides away, knight to b6, bishop backs, knight comes to d5, targeting both of these piece, if you try to save your rook, for example rook g3, then knight takes, takes, the bishop will escape soon, your king position and structure will be very bad. So, in this position, Arnon finds a critical move f3, because it blocks the bishop line, if knight takes rook, then bishop takes, king will arrive to collect the bishop, two pieces for a rook, which is winning for white, and if you think, knight takes knight, then takes, takes, bishop here, takes, then king here to grab the bishop, again knight and bishop for a rook, white will manage to win the position, so, black played bishop b4, pressuring the knight, king f2, bishop takes, b takes c3, queen takes c3. Targeting the rook, rook slides, if you take the rook, then bishop takes, king takes bishop, again the same variation. So, we have queen takes d4, making pressure on this rook, king takes bishop is not possible because of knight takes rook, forking the king and queen, bishop takes, then queen takes, black will win the game, so Arnand rook takes b7, his strategy is to play h6, no matter if you take it or push it, bishop will come to g6, I will come to this point later, Joel played rook to d8, we have h6, no matter if you take or push it, he takes the pawn, and chess friends. Pause the video and find out the brilliant move for Arnand, go, 1, 2, 3, ok if you find bishop to g6, then you are right, the bishop can be taken by the two pawns, and it's hang the queen, and the e3 rook, let me show you one by one, you can't take the bishop, because of this, you will lose your queen, and if you take the queen, then rook takes e6 check, pawn can't take it, because it's pinned, so, king slides, here comes killer move bishop takes h6 check, king runs, then bishop takes, checkmate. What a beautiful checkmate by Vichy Arnand, so, in this position, if you think, well, let me take your rook first, then bishop takes, king here, queen takes, rook takes, bishop takes, this is coming, mate is unstoppable I think, so, back to the position, we have knight back to e7, targeting the queen, and bishop, opening up the line for the rook, blocking the bishop line, blocking the rook's file, so, in this position, Vichy Arnand takes the queen first, rook takes queen, Arnand played rook to d3, if rook takes. 
Then bishop takes, rook check will come and your bishop is in jail because he did a crime in his previous birth, so, in this position, black retreats his rook, because if you take it, then king takes, if rook check happen, then knight will block it with the supporting of the king, so rook takes rook, we have king takes rook, bishop packs, bishop here and after bishop to e2, black decided to resign the game, because there is no way to come back from this position. First of all white is threatening to take the bishop, bishop will threat to the rook, bishop can come to f5 to target the knight with bishop and rook. I played from each side, let's see how the game will be end. Wish you all the best, thanks for watching, subscribe for more, bye bye take care see you in my next video.